everyone, my name is Aga Tompkins. Welcome to my channel. If you want to know all about this Amika Bust Your Brass Mask and you want to find out how to get your hair from this to this, then stay tuned and I'll show you how I did it. All right, so let's get right to it. I am going to use this Amika Bust Your Brass Mask. I don't know if you guys have seen it at Sephora or in your local salon. I have this little tiny section of blonde hair and I need to, I feel like I need to get a still picture of it. Hang on. All right, so I'm gonna get straight to it. I'm just gonna put a little bit of this mask into a bowl. I'm not gonna need very much because let's be honest, I have the tiniest little blonde section. But I figured, you know what? I might not be all blonde, but that little section gets really brassy anyway. So I have a little bit here and we're gonna go straight to it. I might need to use a mirror. So I'm just gonna kinda paint it on there. Probably should have worn gloves. Of course I didn't bring gloves. Oh well. So I'm just slopping it on and obviously if you have a full head of blonde then just go ahead and do it to your whole head. Easy breezy. Hopefully you guys can kind of see. And it looks really purple, so don't be scared, okay? Everything's gonna be okay. Even if you're platinum, don't be scared. You got this. The mask looks like this in the jar. It comes with a little topper to make sure everything is kind of safe in there. And then the cap. Boom. So this is an intense repair mask. If you either are blonde and want cooler tone blonde, or even if you're like a warmer of any tone color, you can use this to kind of cut out some of the warmth. It's clinically proven to repair hydrated tone brassy damaged hair. If you have damaged hair and it's been bugging, which with blondes, obviously often the hair is just damaged. Like, let's be honest. If you're bleaching your hair, there's some damage there, period. It says to do it on damp hair, and I did it on dry hair, but I don't mind if it's a little bit purpley-ish, which I don't think it will be still. It will tone it out, but if you're a blonde and you're not trying to go too ashy, definitely do it on wet hair, and it'll go through your hair easier being wet. So doing it dry, there's more of a chance that you can kind of color it since your cuticle isn't full of water. So just be aware of that. If your hair is lightened and there's different levels of like if you have rings and stuff like that it will not cover evenly so this is just a toning system kind of like a temporary toning system and it says to leave it on for three to five minutes I'm going to leave it on a little longer but so you can kind of get an idea of what it's like after like 10 minutes and then I'll wash it out and then make sure you rinse well and you'll use it as a weekly treatment so now that it's been on for a little bit I'm gonna go wash it out and I'll be right back and let's see what happens BRB alrighty and here is the finished product it definitely kicked some of that brass out of there and I love it I might use it more than once a week I don't know maybe it's not good for it because it'll make buildup so you don't want to do that either but they do also have a shampoo and a conditioner so you can use those more often this is more of a once a week type treatment I'm excited because I haven't tried this on myself yet because I didn't really have blonde in my hair this works out perfect because now I have a new favorite thing for my bang duh hope that helped you guys decide whether you want to try this mask or not I'm pumped about it the other thing is I also feel like my hair feels shinier and silkier like I don't know if you guys can tell the difference but it is definitely better and it was like a little mask so nice you know, like I kind of want to put it all over all my hair. But they have other masks. I'll tell you guys all about all the masks, but this one's great for blondes. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for stopping by. If this is your first time here, nice to meet you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment for more fun videos. Because they're fun, obviously. Hello. No. Thanks, guys. See you next time. Bye.